Hello, young math enthusiasts. Are you ready for some fun with division? Dive right into our math quiz for kids channel for exciting division challenges. And if you're ready to test your skills, give us a thumbs up and subscribe right away. Thirty-two divided by eight is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number thirty-two by eight. Each group contains eight units, so dividing thirty-two by eight results in four equal groups. Thus, the result is. 32 divided by 8 equals to 4. Fifteen divided by 5 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 15 by 5. Each group contains 5 units, so dividing 15 by 5 results in 3 equal groups. Thus, the result is 15 divided by 5 equals to 3. 15 divided by 3 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 15 by 3. Each group contains 3 units, so dividing 15 by 3 results in 5 equal groups. Thus, the result is 15 divided by 3 equals to 5. 14 divided by 7 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 14 by 7. Each group contains 7 units, so dividing 14 by 7 results in 2 equal groups. Thus, the result is 14 divided by 7 equals to 2. 28 divided by 7 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 28 by 7. Each group contains 7 units, so dividing 28 by 7 results in 4 equal groups. Thus, the result is 28 divided by 7 equals to 4. 42 divided by 7 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 42 by 7. Each group contains 7 units, so dividing 42 by 7 results in 6 equal groups. Thus, the result is 42 divided by 7 equals to 6. 40 divided by 5 is time to think. Let's Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 40 by 5. Each group contains 5 units, so dividing 40 by 5 results in 8 equal groups. Thus, the result is 40 divided by 5 equals to 8. 18 divided by 2 is time to think.
Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 18 by 2. Each group contains 2 units, so dividing 18 by 2 results in 9 equal groups. Thus, the result is 18 divided by 2 equals to 9. Sixty-four divided by eight is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number sixty-four by eight. Each group contains eight units, so dividing sixty-four by eight results in eight equal groups. Thus, the result is 64 divided by 8 equals to 8. 8. What is 14 divided by 2? Picture this. You You have 14 objects to divide into groups of 2. How many groups can you make? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Let's imagine you have 14 objects. Can you picture them lined up? What is 9 divided by 3? Picture this. You have nine objects to divide into groups of three. How many groups can you make? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Let's imagine you have nine objects. Can you picture them lined up? What is 80 divided by eight? Picture this. You have 80 objects to divide into groups of 8. How many groups can you make? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Let's imagine you have 80 objects. Can you picture them lined up? What is 20 divided by 2? Picture this. You have 20 objects to divide into groups of two. How many groups can you make? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Let's imagine you have 20 objects. Can you picture them lined up? Now, think about splitting them equally into smaller groups of... What is 21 divided by three? Picture this. You have 21 objects to divide into groups of three. How many groups can you make? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Let's imagine you have 21 objects. Can you picture them lined up? Now what is 30 divided by three? Picture this. You have 30 objects to divide into groups of three. How many groups can you make? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Let's imagine you have 30 objects. Can you picture them lined up? Now, think about splitting them equally into... Sp 56 divided by seven is time to think.
Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 56 by 7. Each group contains 7 units, so dividing 56 by 7 results in 8 equal groups. Thus, the result is 56 divided by 7 equals to 8. Forty-eight divided by eight is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number forty-eight by eight. Each group contains eight units, so dividing forty-eight by eight results in six equal groups. Thus, the result is 48 divided by 8 equals to 6. 35 divided by 7 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 35 by 7. Each group contains 7 units, so dividing 35 by 7 results in 5 equal groups. Thus, the result is 63 divided by 9 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 63 by 9. Each group contains 9 units. So dividing 63 by 9 results in 7 equal groups. Thus the result is 63 divided by 9 equals to 7. 40 divided by 8 is time to think. Divide the number 40 by 8. Each group contains 8 units, so dividing 40 by 8 results in 5 equal groups. Thus, the result is 40 divided by 8 equals to 5. How many did you get right? We bet you did awesome! Remember, practice makes perfect. Don't forget to click the like button if you had fun and subscribe so you can join us for even more division quiz adventures. Let's keep the math magic alive.